What's up everybody? Today we have something very special. We have another MTV Pro unboxing. That's right, MTV Pro unboxing. This is gonna be for February 2018. But I don't know how it happened. I don't know why it happened. But MTV Pro and Mystery Tackle Box didn't just send me one. MTV actually did see one of my videos, they did comment on it, and I'm gonna have to assume that they sent me two boxes. The reason why I think that is because they're actually two totally different boxes. If they were the same box with the same things inside of them, I would say, simple mistake. All I can do and say is, thank you MTV. Make sure you guys check them out. I absolutely love doing these unboxings because I just love fishing gear. I'm a big fan of MTV. I think the product inside is awesome. So. Without further ado, let's jump in and unbox box one. We have the Lucky John, the Akara, which is this bad boy. Comes in at $9.99. Looks like a very standard rattle trap um, with some pretty great colors to it. Look at that bad boy. Looks super good. Really smooth finish. I actually think this looks super good. Uh, really looking forward to throwing this. Finally, the ice has come off the water here. So trying some of these is finally an option. So I'm gonna finally start to go out and fish again here in Chicagoland area. It does have a rattle. Ooh, I just I just took myself. So for $9.99, good little bait. Number two on the list is we have the Venom Mad Tom. So this is gonna be really similar to like a Ned Rig, um, but has a very different look to it. They're calling it a Ven Rig opposed to a net rig. I don't want to take these out of the package too much because they are soft plastics, but it comes with a little hook, a little weighted head here, as well as these little guys. Hopefully you can see those. They say these are great for large mouth, small mouth, walleye, all that kind of great stuff. Basically you throw it out, rigged up, let it sink on slack line, and just watch for the tick. Uh, it has instructions on the back, I was cheating. I love throwing soft plastics. So soft plastics are like my go-to whenever I'm going fishing anywhere. I pick up a soft plastic first, toss that out there. That is what my personal comfort bait is. So for me, this is gonna be right in my wheelhouse. This has got like a dark blue, black flake type of thing. Right now this might work really well in some stained water by my house. Uh, there's a couple ponds right here. Maybe if I take out the kayak or the canoe, throw this down and just kind of let it and wait it out. You know, just wait it out. Wait for it. Bait number three, exo stick. All right, so bait number three is a biospawn soft plastic worm style. This is gonna be very similar to like a Sanko, but a slightly different take. These are very much gonna be really wiggly, really soft, soft plastic. It does have like a little bit of a taper to it. I would say throw these just like you would any type of Sanko worm. You're gonna want to maybe wacky rig. It's a weird smell. Bioscent is what they call it. Sorry, I can smell it on my hand. They call it Bioscent, but I think that's actually going to be a really good thing. It's, they call it life form. Use this just like any other stick bait, any kind of Sanko that you have. This is going to be good spring, fall, summer, really all year round for the most part, especially if you're in the south. Clear water for this. It's definitely not dark enough to be throwing in stained water, so super clear water. This is going to be a really good bait. So the Venrig was $4.99. The Biospawn, $5.99. Next up is we have Carl's Stash Power Spinner. So anything that's gonna be a Carl's Stash item is going to be an MTB exclusive. It's gonna be their own MTB item. That's cool. So they've done uh, two different types in this, this one. These are both essentially like uh, add-on spinners. 
that you can add to the end of a stick bait. They did give you two different leaf styles, which is cool. They give you a little trial pack for each one of these. For this, they're only charging you $250. Uh, for this, they're only going to charge you... For this, it's only listed at $250. So I think that's a really good price point for something like this. I'll give it a shot. Next up, we have the Stickies Wacky Drop Shot Hooks. I talked about this logo in the last video. I love this little logo. So they're gonna give us a couple of two aught wacky hooks. So we have a five set of wacky slash drop shot hooks. If you can see that little bad boy right there. Good looking little wacky drop shot hook. These are gonna be great for exactly what I was explaining with these biospawn bad boys. So you can use these with these, have a wacky rig, drop that out there, little Flop, flop, flop in the wind. I know the perfect pond for this. <laughs> and the stickies are going for 350. Next up, we have the Berkeley Cutter 110 Plus, which is this monster jerk bait. Now this bad boy is gonna go three to six feet deep in the water. This is gonna be perfect if you're fishing from your boat. If you're talking some early spring fishing, this is gonna be a great bait. You're gonna be able to get this down pretty deep where the fish already are. It's suspending, it has a rattle. Early spring, this is gonna crush fish. With the sound and everything, it's perfect for that early spring bite. When the fish are still a little lazy, uh, they don't wanna you know, chase after bait just yet, and the size of this is gonna give you a great meal for a fish. They're gonna go, I don't, I don't, I don't, and go right after it. I love jerk baits that have three hooks. This is gonna be phenomenal. I'm hoping to use this really soon. It's just crazy. This is like almost one of those hologram style. It's not gonna translate real well in picture or in the camera here, but this is almost like holographic. So this bad boy is gonna get some work. And the cutter is listed at $7.99. I actually think that's a deal for this. I would say something like this normally would be at least $10. You know, if you went into Bass Pro Shop, something like that, I feel like that's a $10 bait personally. So good stuff. Next up is the Stan Sloan Zorro Bait. This is gonna be just a standard swim jig. You've been getting these a fair amount in, um, in these boxes for a good reason. This is gonna be a bait that you can use, again, early spring, uh, right when the fish start spawning. When you cast it out, this is gonna work good in you know, stained or clear water due to the colors on here. Cast this out. As you're retrieving, you just kinda give it a little bump bump, slowly bring it in, but you know, give it a couple bumps. It's gonna give the skirt of this a little puff as it comes across and look awesome in the water. So this is something you're really gonna wanna look out for. These little swim jigs are just gonna be killer, especially, you know, non-vibrating kind of thing, early spring, this is gonna be. Last but not least, we have the Smart Baits Gobi. But opposed to the standard, like, paddle tail type swim bait, these are gonna have a totally different little look for ya. Little red on the bottom, this is gonna look fantastic swimming through the water, a cross between a swim bait and like um, a, a lizard or something along those lines. Uh, this is something you can do work a whole bunch of different ways. Texas rig it with a little bit of a weight on there, nothing too heavy. And uh, again, this is gonna be a very clear water bait because of the color base. Uh, they're calling it... Oh, and this changes color. Oh, wow. All right, so fun fact, uh, I did not know this, but this is a color changing bait. So this is gonna go from red and blue to chartreuse and pearl. I'm gonna assume it's gonna change based on the temperature of the water. Uh, color change is always, you know, if you're talking about like a mood ring or anything that changes colors, it's always gonna be based around heat. So uh, based upon if this is a cold, it's gonna to change to one color. If it's hot, it's gonna to change to another color. Typically, it goes from darks to lights. Uh, so colder is gonna be the darker colors. Warmer is gonna be the brighter colors. Uh, I don't know if that's true with this, but I'm guessing just based on what I can see with the colors inside of here and what my hand is just kind of doing to it by holding on to it, is that that's gonna be the case. So it's gonna go from blood red to a chart reuse and then blue to pearl. Looks like there's only four in here, so this is gonna be more of a sampler pack. Even then, I kinda like sampler packs, so. 
nothing wrong with that. And just to give you an idea, it, it is a heat-based thing. Red to the pearl, and that's just because I had it in my hand, and you can definitely see that color difference. The cool thing about this box specifically is most of the baits in it are marked as what is considered a new product. So you'll see on the actual dibble that there's an N next to it, which means a new item or an M, which is an MTB exclusive. So this one has almost all new or MTB exclusive items in it. So to me, this is a very cool box. This is so far the one that I've seen as a standard uh, that other people are getting, uh, specifically like YouTubers and other people are getting for the month of February. When you pay for it, it's $25. But what you're getting is $43.94 in product. That's an awesome deal. I mean, I would love to go into any pro shop, any bass fishing store, any tackle shop, spend $25 and get over $40 worth of baits. That's insane to me. Let's move on to box two. <sighs> the smell of baits in the morning. Again, I really do thank MTB. I do believe that they sent this to me as a gift uh, for doing all of these videos. So thank you guys so much. Uh, over at MTB. Whoever said saw this, whoever posted on my channel, thank you very, very much. Um, this is awesome. First up, we have the Sunfish Hollow Body Live Target. I actually have a couple of these and I love them. They're very similar to like um, a topwater frog. However, they are an actual fish. So you're gonna work this just like any topwater frog. It's gonna have a very condensable body. So when the fish bite it, those hooks are gonna be exposed. You pull and they're gonna be right there. Looks just like a real fish. Small bluegill are the forage for bass everywhere. If bluegill are in that pond and bass are in that pond, the bass are eating bluegill. They show that the listed price for this is $12.99. I've seen these go for much more in Bass Pro Shop and other stores, so these bad boys are, I mean, this is like as good as gold. This is a great little lure, and I'm really pumped that I got it in this box. Next, we have the 3DS Shad by Yozerm. So this is gonna be another style of jerkbait. They had a similar lure to this in last month's box, although I wouldn't call it the same, just similar. So this is also gonna have a very much of a sunfish look, but it's gonna be a much smaller jerkbait. You can throw this on you know, your standard rod and reel, but this one's gonna dive a little bit deeper. I'm gonna bet this is probably a two to four foot jerk bait. This is something that you're gonna be able to throw almost year round for a small suspending jerk bait like this. You know, in winter you really want to downsize because the fish become much more lackadaisical. They sit on the bottom, they don't want to do much. So when you have the suspending, the jerking motion of it, and it just sits there for a while, especially at that kind of range of two to four feet, uh, they're gonna come up and get this bad boy. Because I think this will be best probably in clear water. Yet again, uh, a lot of clear water baits recently. I think this will be another one to throw in the bin. All right, next up we have the True Spin by Lunker Hunt. Lunker Hunt is actually a company that I don't have many lures from. I'm actually kind of okay with the concept of not having them because now I'm getting them, which is great. Definitely not an underspin. Wow, wow, that is heavy. For such a little, so you see this guy here, okay? And you think, wow, that's a really little bait. But it's really, really heavy. Like, this is solid metal. I'm really surprised by the size of this, uh, especially with this little spinner on the back here. So, I have no idea how to fish this at all. I'm gonna guess it's gonna be just like any, uh, any crankbait type style, let it toss it out there. It can drop down pretty quick, pull it through some weeds and uh, get reaction bites, especially with the tail here. I actually think that I, you'll catch crappie on this a lot too, just by the pure design of it. I might try and catch some crappie on this. I know that the crappie are hitting. I think that this is gonna be a fun little bait to try. It's definitely something that is not in my normal tackle lineup. It's not something that I aim to throw typically, but now that I have this, I plan on trying to use it. You don't just get tackle and not use it. But that's the beauty of MTB. You get to try new stuff. Next up, we have the Swagger Worm by Buddha Baits. Whoa, yo, all right, Buddha Baits. This has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This has eight, whoa, whoa. This has eight worms in it with this crazy huge paddle tail. Look at that bad boy. 
and I can smell the garlic from a mile away. This thing is just soaked in garlic. Wow, that's a lot of garlic. Uh, this looks like it's a green pumpkin to me, so this is gonna work good in most bodies of water. Green pumpkin works everywhere, especially with a little bit of water clarity. I would say throw this Texas rig and use this like you would any like ribbon tail worm. Throw it out, let it drop, give it a couple little pop pops, and let that ribbon tail just kind of flutter in the wind. I, I'm actually looking forward to really using this. This is kind of in my wheelhouse of throwing a lot of creature baits, soft plastics. That garlic smell, which is, wow, really strong. I mean, I can still smell it in my hand really heavily. Yeah, you're gonna get some, some fish to hit that just out of the pure smell of garlic. I mean, if they like garlic, they're, they're going after that. Next up, we have the Grass Kicker by Xenia. The Grass Kicker. So this is a big old swim bait here. Oh my, how am I gonna hold this? Big old swim bait here. This is gonna look like a blueback herring. There are a lot of fish that will hit this. If you, if you have blueback herring in your body of water, this is a go-to bait for you. Bass will school up to eat herring. Wow, that's really brilliant. What they've done here, I don't think you'll be able to see well, is that they actually split the back fin. So if you can see this here, they split the back fin so that you can fit your hook from, you know, just like you would normally under and where it's out the back, so that it just sits right inside of this, this back dorsal fin. Because with that, you will be able to get a little bit better hook set. It doesn't have to go through as much plastic, and you can really just, these are five inch swim baits in the blueback herring color by Z-Man. And these are listed for 449. The Buddha baits were 549 and the true spin was 699 holy cow and the 3d shad was 999 that's pretty dope and last but not least we have the super swimmer junior four more that is a big that is a big bag for four little swim baits the listed price is 188 so this is definitely like a tester set oh, going along with the theme i mean this bag is mostly plastic it'll, you know has a lot of soft plastics um Ooh, another really strong garlic smell. But again, just another basic little swim bait. Cool color, got a lot of shine to it, so great for clear water. Whoever this, whoever makes this, who's this, Bruiser Baits? You may want to rethink your packaging. I mean, what are you doing here? What, what is this? Like, come on, come on. Do you really need, do you really need the Magnum bag for your swim bait? Really? And as always, they hook it up with the stickers. Man, I love the stickers. Wow, and box number two comes out to $41.75. So in both boxes, you know, no matter what box you got, you still ended up, getting, ended up getting over a $40 value per box. Gotta give it to them. The guys over, the guys and girls over at Mystery Tackle Box are giving you a heck of a deal on any box that you get. So make sure you check them out at mysterytacklebox.com. As always guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I really do appreciate it. I love doing these videos for you guys and I'd love to keep doing them. So until next time guys, happy foozin'.